Good morning, besties. It is almost 12. I just woke up. I'm going to vlog today because I'm going to go to Ulta in Bath & Body Works, I think. And I'm going to go on a coffee run right now, I, I think. <laughs> um, My little sister's sleeping. That's why I'm talking a little bit more quiet. But yeah, those are the plans for the day. And I'm going to bring you guys along with me. Good morning, lovers. <laughs> Good morning! Come mm, here, boy. Oh, mm. Kitty babies. <laughs> Why is it blurry? Look at that! Look how he gets when I get my keys. <laughs> Bye, marbles. Bye! Come on. <laughs> I'm Look a little bit more happy, baby. <laughs> no, I'm freezing. Mom, push back. Are yeah, we going to Starbucks? You didn't get a pumpkin because you don't even finish them. You only like them from Dunkin' or from. That's it. Is it for Riva or for Bajo? You want it to be harder, so you're going to make it higher. I'm trying to taste test my coffee, but I lost my straw, so I guess I'm gonna taste it. Well, I can't taste it right because it's How not put a spoon on. your straw? You didn't put it like in the lado, like where you could put your... No. Mmm, that's good. Have you never tried this one? Mm-mm. Wow, this is... Mmm, that is delicious. Mm. This is a venti... I'm on the right to side, right? Or no? Yes, toasted vanilla shaken espresso. I think that's what it is. But instead of the venti comes with four pumps of um, espresso shots, and I put three pumps, and then it comes with six pumps of toasted vanilla syrup, and I put five pumps, and then I added vanilla. How what's it called? Cold, cold foam? Is that what it's called? It's so good, and it, it comes with um, I don't know if I mentioned, but I think it's oat milk. Yeah, oat milk. Mmm. It's really good. It would be even more good with my straw if I can taste it better. <laughs> but I don't know where it went. <laughs> to do my makeup i'm going to ulta like i said bath and body and tj yeah. maxx so i'm just gonna put on some makeup because i always look ugly but elf um ultra precise brow pencil in neutral brown like always 10 10 recommend this by the way it's really good i'm gonna go ahead and fill in my brows with the elf quad in neutral brown it's like a little brow Quad thing, a little brush. These are from Lorella, by the way, if anybody is wondering. Okay, I'm gonna take it back to an oldie but a goodie. I'm gonna use Modern Renaissance, which is literally years and years old. My sister talking on the phone in the background, by the way. That's who is so loud. I forgot how good Anastasia um, eyeshadows are. They blend so nice. This just blends so good, like so seamless. Next, I'm gonna use my favorite palette ever. Look how beat up it is. This is the um, Soft Glam by Anastasia. Um, I definitely need a new, new one, but I'm gonna use Rose Pink for my lid shade. These colors are just so good. Like without even wetting it, it looks so nice. But I'm gonna wet it so it can really stick on there. Moisturize these lips with some Vaseline. that can really be absorbed while we continue the rest of our makeup. I'm gonna go on with my favorite eyeliner, or should we do brown? I'm gonna do brown, I think. Um, I'm gonna 
this brown liner from Lorella. I'm just gonna do brown today. Okay, I'm waiting for. I did a light coat of mascara that Lash and Roll from from Elf. I can't talk. And I'm gonna wait for my um, lash glue to dry a little bit. I I moisturized my face, and then I'm gonna go ahead. Marbles, be quiet. I'm gonna go ahead and prime. Today I'm gonna use the Urban Decay Optical Illusion Complexion Primer. I don't even think they sell this anymore. Like it was discontinued. Um, I think I found mine like at TJ Maxx or something. But it's like this like thicker. It kind of reminds me of the putty primer, but like in a pump rather than that other. Obviously, the putty pr primer packaging is like a little tub. But that's what this kind of reminds me. It makes my skin look really smooth, kind of blurs it out. I actually really like it. For foundation, I'm going to use the True Skin Foundation from Catrice. I have it and I never use it, honestly, so I'm just going to use it. This one's in warm beige. It is like a shade too late for me. But... Like I said, I have it, so I'm going to use it. I always just, like, I notice that foundations are too light for me, but then I'm too lazy to return them, so I just keep them. Oh, this one actually doesn't look that bad. Why did I think it was so light? My next one is definitely too light, but I still wear it like that because I don't want Yeah, this one's just, like, a shade too light, but I can make it work with bronze to... Okay, I don't wear it. I don't use this more often. It looks really nice on the skin. Like, it looks like a velvety matte finish, kind of, but it's not flat or anything. It's not drying. Like, it still looks like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, it still looks like a little, like, it looks healthy. It doesn't look, like, completely matte. Um, I really like it, but let me put on my lashes, and we'll continue with the face because my lash glue is dry. This is how I put them up. I just look down on a mirror. This is how I put them on. I just look down on a mirror like this. And just apply them. Okay, lashes are on. I'm just gonna use the concealer to match the foundation. So the True Skin Concealer. This one is in the shade. What shade did I get? Neutral Biscuit. And using a beauty blender. This one's an original beauty blender. I used to be like, oh my god, what's the point of the beauty blender? So there's so many sponges. And I mean, there is a lot of good sponges out there, right? But I don't know. I'm just, I don't think anything really compares to the beauty blender. Like the quality of it. It's really nice. <laughs> and sometimes you can find them on sale, like at TJ Maxx and stuff. Especially like sets, like if they had had holiday sets and stuff, then they will sell them at TJ Maxx, like the leftovers. Essence Brain Powder. I know it's like barely any left, but I'm using it a lot because I love this powder. I do have a backup already, so. This is one of those products that I cannot live without because it's on my everyday makeup routine. So if I'm running low, I have to make sure I have a backup. Okay, we're going to cream contour, cream bronze. I'm going to use the Mario um, sculpting stick in medium. And I'm just going to get, uh, where is my brushes? Brush here. And I'm just going to get it off from the tube. Sometimes I just go and like mark my face with this, but sometimes I do this. It just depends. If you want more control over the product, I recommend doing this. If you maybe want a little bit more intense bronze, maybe just draw it on your face. For blush, I'm using Candy Paint. This is from Half Cake Cosmetics. This is in Club Paradise. It's a blush. I'm gonna set with Rare Beauty's powder. This one is just in translucent, I think, or oh no, light. This one's in light. Okay, after that, I'm actually gonna set over that with some pressed powder, and this one is the CoverGirl Clean Fresh in translucent. 
obviously it's just like a white translucent powder but it's not like other translucent white powders that leave like a white cast on your face like this just really sets your makeup nicely without leaving that white cast we're just gonna make sure our makeup stays i'm gonna bronze now with something that i have not used in forever this is the kat von d um shade and light palette i don't even know do they still sell these because i know obviously kat von d like rebranded like she doesn't own the brand anymore So I don't know if they still sell this, but I really like it. I'm going to just top off my blush with this powder blush by Wet n Wild. This is my Cherry Amour blush. They don't sell this anymore. So, yeah, it's an older part. <laughs> I'm going to do, I guess I'll mix a little bit of both. Very pigmented, so be careful. Mm, rub it on my nose, tap it off, and okay. I'm gonna do highlighter. This is Catrice More Than Glow Highlighter in Beyond Golden Glow. I don't know where you can get Catrice now. I know, obviously, on their website, you used to be able to get it at Ulta, which is where I got my products from, but they stopped selling it there. I don't know why. How pretty that is. Oh, yes, girl. Yes. Let's glow to the quads. Okay. I finished my lower lash line. And then for lips, I'm going to go in with this Revlon Color Stay Lip Pencil in Rose. Oops. I think that's too light. So I filled them in with that as well, but I think I need something a little bit darker. I'm gonna use, let's see. Do I have coconut from Kylie? Coconut, I'm gonna use coconut just a little bit on the outer. Okay, perfect. So then I'm just going to top it off with the Wet n Wild Liquid Catsuit High Shine Lipstick. This one is in Send Nudes. So this is going to give you color, like if it's... um. A lipstick, but it gives you the shine like a lip gloss, so it's a two in one. I feel like is that too light or does it look okay? I think it looks fine. Okay, cool. And then I'm just gonna set everything. What setting spray did I bring? I'm gonna set everything with a Morphe, which I'm not, I have not used continuous setting, setting mist. I love the mist, but that is it for the makeup. I really like the foundation. I need to use that more for sure. It looks really nice and I think it matches my neck pretty well. Okay, cool. Now I'm going to do my hair and get an outfit ready and head out. Here is the casual outfit because after the store I'm going to go work out on my mom's. Um, Calvin Klein t-shirt. This is from Ross, I think. And then leggings are my favorites from Target, and I'm just wearing some Adidas, and I'm gonna wear. Oh, let's get off of my jacket. This from Black, fluffy like hoodie jacket. So comfy. My sister got this for me. So shout out to her. It's so cozy. Just a super cash outfit with like makeup on and hair done and everything, but I feel good. <laughs> this is what I got going on left of my little pouch <laughs> of the belly um it's not too bad i have a bunch of stretch marks obviously but um yeah it's not nothing crazy because i've been eating healthy and working out so that's slowly going down we're going to ulta and bath and body and tj max i'll put it on right now hi people 
she doesn't have a stand for me and also I'm gonna get copyrighted but oh, yeah, she doesn't have a, st a little um what do you call it a mount maybe I should buy one for this car <laughs> <laughs> no my mom's gonna buy one <laughs> don't do that ooh Brenda can vlog me at Ulta because I don't like vlogging myself at Ulta <laughs> <laughs> wow this foundation looks so good guys love and the blush looks real pretty too we're going back home because we forgot <laughs> we forgot my parents garage remote and we can't get into the house because that's the only way we can get in because the front door has a lot of locks <laughs> oh my God, we're, so we're so dumb so we're going back to my apartment because oh yeah, your car yeah girl it's normal we're going back to the apartment to get it and then we're, and we're literally here like we literally got here like we got off the freeway and this is where my parents live but we have to go back so <laughs> That's fun. And it's raining and it starts into rain. Mm. <laughs> My bush. What do you want to say to the people, Marbles? That we're idiots. Marbles is not interested in saying anything to you guys. Marbles? He's looking at me. POV, Marbles. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb and we forgot to vlog. Oh, my hair girl. To vlog at Ulta and Bath and Body and TJ Maxx because I was looking for all these make makeup products that I wanted that they did not have and it said they had them like online it's available in stores and we went and i literally found nothing that i wanted so i asked an employee for the like the main thing that i went for which was the foundation and she went to check in the back and they had it so at least i got the foundation but we were all wrapped up in that so i didn't vlog but now i'm with my parents and i'm gonna go work out i just do like a 30 minute workout every day so i'm just gonna go walk on the treadmill for 30 minutes and then we're gonna head home and my boyfriend i think is gonna make an asada today so i'm gonna eat that i haven't even ate anything because i don't really get hungry in the morning and I have my coffee like I finished it and that filled me up so I'm gonna have some kind of all later hopefully we're heading home now I worked out and look my makeup is still on <laughs> I'm trying, we went to Starbucks and I just wanted chocolate chip cookie and she got me some um, egg white, egg bites. These have roasted pepper, I think roasted red pepper, um, some cheese and I think spinach. I've never tried them and they're really popular so I'm going to try them. Oh, they look so good and they smell so good. Look at this. Mmm. Oh, wow, that's pretty good. And it has literally like 100 calories, I think. <laughs> Mm, they need a little bit of salt, <laughs> yeah. but I think that's why they don't have that many calories. Mm. Pretty good. So these are the foundations that I got at Ulta. They're from Essence, and I got two shades. I got light, medium, and buff. Because the girl convinced me to get both. Because <laughs> she was like, I think this one's gonna be like your winter shade, and this one's gonna be like your summer shade. But they almost look exactly the same to me. This one looks a little bit lighter in person, but we'll just have to see. I'm gonna swatch. That's a pump. This one's light medium. What? Man, for a new foundation girl, that... Oh, that does look pretty light. I don't know. Man, but it's so effing creamy. That looks light. Oh, thank you, love. <laughs> ah, my sort of dirty. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have taken it off before I... Duh. Compared it to this one, right? But... Usually new foundations need like so much oh. um, pumps. Yes and no. Oh, okay. I feel like Loki, this is going to be my shade. Oh, yeah. The other one did look I light. think the other one looks too light. This one's the other one. Mm. This one's light, medium, and this one is buff. Uh, 110 buff. I think I'm going to be buff. Oh, this is buff. <laughs> this one looks a little too light. They almost look the same, honestly, but I think I'm gonna be. The other one looks like it blends a little bit better to your. Yeah. Face. We'll see. I'm gonna try it tomorrow. We'll, we'll see. And then I'll just go return one. So I won't both. <laughs> I'm gonna do some sleepy time tea. I'm doing this every night. I just get one. that is gonna be the end of the vlog besties i hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys in my next one bye